in this video I'm going to discuss uh, some strategies uh, when you're dividing by um, 0.5 or 0.25 or 1.25. So let's start uh, by taking on some simple examples by dividing by decimals. Suppose let us take an example say 57 you want to divide by 0 0.5. Now whenever you're dividing by decimals students do get anxious they don't know what to do now, so when you're dividing uh, what you can do is if you have you're dividing by a decimal uh, you can change that decimal to a whole number so before I explain this suppose let me take a simple example where you don't have a decimal suppose 12 divided by say 3 we know is 4 okay so 12 divided by 3 is same as, if you double this, that is same as 24 divided by 6. So this is 4 and this is also 4. So if you double this, you would also double this. That is same as if you double this, say 48 divided by 12. That is also 4. So what I'm saying is, if you... Uh, increase and now increase this okay you'd also increase the divisor by the same proportion so what I'm going to do is I am going to double this so I know the double of 0.5 is 1 so if I double this to make this a whole number I would also double this so what happens is so this question changes to what is double of 57 so double of 50 is 100 and double of 7 is 14 so this is a 114 divided by 1 and that is pretty easy so that is 114 so the answer is 114 so here you can write 114 is the answer okay let us take the next example uh, say if it is 1.2 or 12.3 divided by 0 0.5 so you've got two decimals. This is a, a number with, uh, this is a decimal number, and this is also a decimal number. Yeah, uh, let us change this. You can do this in different ways. So let me double this. If you double this, you have to also double this. So double of 12 is 24, and double of 0 0.3 is 0 0.6. So this is 24.6. Divided by one, so the answer is 24.6. Okay, can we do this in a different way? Well, we can. So what we can do is, let us write this question: 12.3 divided by 0 0.5. So yeah, this is this has one number after the decimal point, and this has also one number after the decimal point. So well, if I times this by 10. So this will become 123. So this also you have to multiply by 10. So this is 123 divided by 5. Okay, now this, I'm going to double this to make it 10. So it also double this. So this is 146 divided by 10. That also gives you the same answer. Oh, double, sorry. Uh, this is not 143, sorry. So double of one, 120. So if, it, if you want to double this, so this is 100, uh, double of 100 is 200, 200, and double of, this 2 stands for 20, so this is 40, so this is 246, so this is same as 246 divided by 10, which is nothing but 24.6, okay. Uh, let us do one more example say let us change now let us make say 23 divided by 0 0.25 here yeah, you want to make this a whole number so well this first I will double this I'd, because 0.25 times 4 is 1 so uh, you I'm going to double this I'm going to go in stages so if you double this you'd also double this so double of 23 is 46 divided by 0 
which is equal to again I'm going to double if I double this I have to double this so this is 80 and 12 so double of 40 is 80 so if we're doubling this so this is how I double in my uh, in my head so 40 and 40 gives you 80 and 6 and 6 gives you 12 so this is 92 so this is 92 divided by 1 which is 92 okay so this is same as writing 92 okay so yeah okay one more example uh, say 34.7 34.7 divided by 0 0.25 so what can we do the same strategy uh, this is uh, let us change color so this is times this by 2 so you also times this by 2 so this becomes uh, to double this I'll do double first 3 3 stands for 30 so the double of 30 is 60 double of 4 is 8 and double of 0.7 is 1.4 so this is 8.0 and this is 60.0 so this is 0.4 this is 69.4 so this changes to 69.4 divided by 0 0.5 always good to check at each stage so this is you double this by 2 and you also double this by 2 so I'm going to write the double so double of 6, 6 stands for 60, so that's 120, plus double of 9 is 18, and double of 0.4 is 0.8. So this is 138.8. Uh, so this is 138.8 divided by 1. And that is pretty easy, that is nothing but 138.8.